Well, friends, it's time to get our max to Sana. Let's go ahead and depart. Commander, I've tried contacting both the COC and the Fusiliers to alert them to our plight. But since their impending invasion of Sana is considered top secret, their entire unit is operating under a communications blackout until they secure Sana. But by that time, it will be too late for us. We will need to dispatch you to Sana on your own. Your mission will be to link up with the 5th Search's Fusiliers Combat Commander, General Gordon Hearthstone, rest in pepperoni, or the Battle Mac Regiment Commander, Colonel Anthony Harkness, and deliver this very graph message for myself explaining our situation. Once you've made contact with them, your objective on Sana is to find the location of Sana's Maskarovka headquarters and demolish it before they can decrypt the Third Cruise's codebooks. See if General Hearthstone or Colonel Harkness can spare some forces to support you once you have made contact. Unfortunately, due to Sarna's distance through hostile space and with jump ship availability being in short supply, the best we could master for you is a route that will take you take over three months before you arrive at Sarna and another 16 days traveling from the jump point to the planet itself. By the time you touch down, it will be almost a month after the Fusiliers have initiated the invasion of the planet. If everything goes well, by the time you reach Sarna, they should have a strong foothold already established in system. Yeah, we do know what's happening and uh, McCarran Armored's cavalry is gonna eat these guys alive. Commander, until you make contact with Fizzilius, you will be on your own with no support. So I need to ask, are you absolutely sure that you have all your mechs and equipment queued for refits doing a journey? I have no idea what the situation on Sana will look like by the time you arrive, so be extra sure you've collected all necessary provisions prior to departing. I mean, they're making it very clear. Repair your mechs, now! <laughs> Godspeed, Commander. Contact me once your objective is complete. So, um, this is going to be interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm really interested to see how uh, PGI is going to spin this because uh, we all know what happens on Sana. We all know what happens on Sana, so uh, let's get over there. Oh! Sona, capital system of the Sona commonality. Vibes of StarCraft too. the jewels of the Kapalan Confederation. For centuries, Sona had been a beacon of industry and technological sophistication, once housing large populous cities across all of its continents, feeding a healthy commercial manufacturing industry. But, like the rest of the Inner Sphere, the succession wars brought death and destruction to Sona. Today, although it's only a shadow of its former self, it remains an important world. Its aerospace and dropship manufacturing centers, combined with its centralized location in Kaplan space, have made it a prime target for the Federated Sun's ongoing invasion of the Confederation. House Davion has charged the elite Fifth Certis Fusiliers with taking Sona. In order to complete our mission, we will first need to make contact with their commanding officers, General Gordon Hartstone and Colonel Anthony Harkness. But something seems to be wrong. Although we jumped into the system seven days ago, I have not yet been able to hail anyone on the wideband Federated Sons command channel. I'm getting nothing but silence every time I try. Even more disturbing, the local news is reporting that the Fusiliers have attacked and destroyed Sawyer's HPG relay station, which has cut the system out of contact with the rest of the Inner Sphere spreading panic among Sarna's populace. Our mission to recover the stolen Mio code books is far too important for us to abandon. Whatever the odds, we must make contact with the 5th Certis Fusiliers and request their assistance in finding and destroying the stolen code books. Otherwise, the entire security of Operation Rat could be compromised. Let's just hope we're not too late. Okay. It started, it started slow for cinematic, but it, it got better. Um, <clears throat> let's see if I get to talk a little bit. So I can provide a little bit of, in, a little bit of intel here. So, uh, the 5th Suits Fusiliers are being led by somebody who is fiercely loyal to Duke Michael Hasek Devian, who actually betrayed Federated Sons and was dealing with Chancellor Liao, uh, a back, uh, backhand thingy. But uh, a couple, I think a couple of weeks ago, according or months ago, according to in-game time, uh, he got shot in the head by Justin Xiang. So, that guy's dead. And the Fusiliers, they are a rogue element. And uh, unfortunately, Hans Devian has to 
deal with them somehow. So he just gives them a nice mission, which actually is a suicide mission. And we're now here as well, right in the shit. Okay. Elvex. Everything's repaired. Beautiful. Is my Zeus properly colored? Yes, it is. It's still a trash mech, but it's colored. Mission briefing. We're on our final approach to Sarna, and I'm still getting nothing on the Devian command channel. I'm also picking up a large amount of space debris in shallow orbit right around Sarna's exosphere. It looks to be the debris of a number of destroyed dropships or satellites, but they're too small to make out any discernible origin. Wait a minute. Commander, I'm just beginning to get a read on the 5th Surtis Fusilier's encoded channel. It's incredibly faint. They appear to be sending out an SOS. The message is only a single set of coordinates accompanied by a single repeating text transmission. Mayday! 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 This is 5th Surtis Fusilier's caroling for assistance from any forces loyal to the Federated Sons. We are, need in we are in need of assistance at the following coordinates. Beep, 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 beep. No holoit, no audio, and no declaration of any kind of identification. And the signal on this is so faint that I can't even get a read on anything beyond the text transmission and the coordinates. I don't like this, Commander. I don't like this one bit. Unfortunately, these coordinates are the only lead we have at finding the Fusiliers. And we need those code books and their help, or everything will be lost. If this signal is legitimate, we need to assist the Fusiliers and make contact with General Hearthstone or Colonel Harkness if we are going to have any hope of completing our mission. Be extremely cautious, Commander. This is all the markings of a trap to lure Devian loyalists into an ambush. I would not risk our most effective mechs until we have a better idea what's going on. If it is as bad as it looks, we are going to prepare... You're going to need to prepare for the long haul. So what, use mediums? Is that what she's saying? Like a tonnage limit of, of almost 300 tons, that tells me I need to drop quite heavy, actually. Alright, uh, damage is covered. Let's go max salvage and a little bit of cash. <sighs> what am I dropping in then? Should I just bring the assault mech? Because to be honest, I don't think that Zeus is gonna be insanely, insanely good. I'm gonna try. To, I'm gonna try the Zeus. We still have tonnage left on the field. I can't even fill that drop limit. <laughs> Big drop. Uh, Wolverine is not that good. I mean, Gitaro. Okay. Well, the only thing this thing doesn't... I mean, yeah, we have some long range with the large lasers. Huh. Let's try it, I guess. Hey, this is gonna be bad. Attention. Prepare for battle departure. I smell a trap. The trap is set. Online. Let's go spring it. Alright, weapon groups. The communications disarray caused by the Comstar HPG relay station's destruction has allowed us to land on Zona undetected. Undetected. I'm still not getting any responses on the Federated Sun's wide band. Right. The only thing we're detecting oh, is a base. SOS signal from the lots of mechs. Fusilier. I've marked its approximate and they're all damaged. If there are any it's a patent tank. There, okay. We need to make contact with them ASAP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. have any hope of surviving this deep into Kaplan territory. But be on your guard, Commander. This SOS signal could be a trap. They appear to be members of mm. the Fusiliers, transmitting IFF frequencies to them now. Let's go up and introduce ourselves. All right. If only I could see anything in this gloom. Gloom shroom. There's too many trees here. Who oh, put all those trees in the jungle? Also, um, look at the minimap right now, guys. Do you see this? We've got two mechs of ours that are just rubbing against each other. Huh? Eh? What is this? What are you guys doing up there? You guys need a room or something? Jesus, keep it in your pants, soldiers. Keep it in your virtual pants, soldiers. That's an order.
This used to be a family friendly stream, damn lads mates. <laughs> Alright. So is there a button to toggle max zoom? Like instantly toggle max zoom? Increase zoom, decrease zoom, cycle zoom. Set max zoom, is there a button? No? Huh. So I would like to just zoom to maximum level instantly. At 1.35 zoom doesn't do anything for me. It's kind of pointless. I would like to see like a 2x zoom and a 4x zoom. That would be, that would be helpful. Alright. Let's go meet up. Let's see what happens. I like the jungle biome. Like, the jungle biome feels like a jungle. Like, literally, you don't see anything. Also makes it super hard to hit your targets, right? So, um... Oh! Some deeper water for a change. Nice! This is, this is really cool. I got vibes of that one mission in MechWarrior for Mercs. When you meet the clans Next for the first time. Stay where you are. Your IFF says you're with the second cruise's Lancers. Why are the Lancers here on Sarna? The Lancers aren't here in force. It's only us. We are here on special assignments. Only us. Jackson Davion. We have an urgent matter to discuss with General Hoystone. The general's he's dead. Gone. We Told you. He's in KIA. What about Colonel Harkness? Dead. Definitely KIA. His Marauder was bombarded by Inferno missiles. When he tried to punch out, Inferno gel poured into his cockpit and burned him alive. Rip. Who's in charge here then? I am. You're looking at her. Captain <laughs> Alana Damu, 5th Certus Fusiliers, 1st Battalion. And as much as I would love to know why you're here, that is going to have to wait. We've got bigger problems at the moment. We're waiting on our salvage teams to strip this gazelle Loot. for any surviving provisions. We're not going to make it much longer if we can oh, we have salvage to loot. as much of its supplies as we can. All right, all right. Walk on up to the treasure to pick it up. I'm the loot boss. So do I just loot this now? No, but I'm bug this mission now. We're detecting Liao forces converging on our position. They Survive the onslaught. Lancers, my men are exhausted and stretched to the brink. That's okay. I, not afford to I am a looting. Help us fight through this with minimal losses, and I'll see what I can do about helping you with your special assignment. Don't disturb me. I'm looting. You gotta have priorities in war. And I'm a merc. I'm looting. Oh. Oh, that's a new. Oh, that's a manticore. That manticore tank looks cool. Oh, shit. There's a lot of stuff coming our way. Oh, there's more loot. There's more loot. Yes, 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 yes. Don't mind me, I'm just digging through the wreckage of your dropship. Yoink. Oh, we can go inside. Can we? That's kind of cool, what is that thing? A J. Edgar just lying down here. What the fuck? I can, can I actually walk in this thing? Yeah, hell yeah. I'm staying in here. That's cool. All right. Enemy contact. Shame it's a mech. They might think they have us. What they don't know don't is they're about school. to meet uh, me. If I can get out of here alive. There we go. Wasn't there some more loot though? Guys. Here, handle that centurion. I need to see if there's more loot. No more loot? All right. All trust. That was, that was easy. Fresh Marauder. All right. See, I don't think there is any uh, any check here that that checks whether these mechs are alive in the end or not. So I'm gonna let these guys handle it. Oh, that Marauder though. Okay. Maybe it's time to do some damage. Full firepower. I am bearing down on the enemy. Yes. You wanna shoot me in the back? Shoot me in the front! Lao scum! Yeah! 
Yes. No, oh, what? They're bringing reinforcements for Tango? Bam, ba, da, bam, bam, bam. Why am I thinking Blue Oyster Bar? Whoa! Okay. Ah, there's a lot of dudes. Um, follow me. Everybody, we go back here. Go back here. Uh, go, go here. Go here. Go here. We are, we are protecting our allied units by protecting them bravely from behind. I learned that in MechWarrior Online. Always protect from behind. Alright. Let's see. Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna go bully that catapult and the assassin. Yes. Oh, the catapult's actually learning. Look at that. That mech is heavily damaged. Doing a seamless focus fire. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna give you a focus fire. I'm gonna focus this guy, alright. Hello, stop dying. Perfect. But more. Okay, let's kill that Warhammer. He needs to go. All oh, Alpha Strike Firepower! We're almost ready for melee! Yes! Assault fisticuffs! Wow! Oof. Holy shit! Yep! Told you, McCarran's armored cavalry. I think the story would have been better in between two of those waves. Oh, just hit my ass, Victor. Oh. -oh. Race for compact. Uh, what? Oh, did I get the Igor? No, I did not. No, I got him. Whoa! Jesus, the Zerg is real! This mech is actually not that bad. Uh, we have a raven here very close. And he's starting to annoy me. Where are you? Get over here, little shitter! Oh, he was dead fast. Where did the victor go? Is he still alive? The victor must still be alive. Focus fire on the quick draw. Oh, the Kintaro is going to town. We add a firepower to that, and we take this guy apart. Yep, he just ate it. All right. The victor is just taking a break, apparently. I think he, I pooped out a little bit there. The Zerg are coming, build defensive bunkers. <laughs> I support the idea. It's just the wrong game. But this is a cool mission. It's a cool mission. I like the defense mission. I'm just, I'm just sneaking closer here. Like, you know what's gonna happen to that poor trench bucket in about two seconds. Fall Alpha! No pity, no mercy. No deductions. Uh, what? A victor sticking to book two. Okay, that's the last guy we need to kill, by the way. And he's not coming. I think his, maybe his pathfinding kicked out a little bit. But that was cool. Like, this whole crash site is so well done. Like, the thing is, of course, you gotta say, they got the ideas for these missions from the lore, of course, and from the novels, which there's a lot of stuff in there. But um, this is cool. Like, being able to go into that dropship and then just loot all the stuff, that was super cool. That was super cool. Oh, they're moving towards him. Uh, they took a little bit of damage here. But they're still all alive. 
Magas also still alive. How would we kill the victor, I guess? Um, should we go with the Warhammer? I'm gonna destroy the victor with the Warhammer, I think. It's my freshest mech. New target, victor. Yeah, this whole map is amazing. This whole map is pretty cool. <laughs> this mech, though, four weapon groups. I normally just use two. I'm a simple man, I like two mouse buttons. <laughs> Alright, Victor, we're coming for you! You think you could hide in the bushes? He's probably squatting down in the bushes, having diarrhea or something. They told him not to eat the swamp snakes and the swamp snails. But did you listen? Yeah, visual confirmation. Air, I'll show you visual confirmation. Confirm this! Ah, we're not in range yet. Yeah, now we're in range. Bye bye. Captain Tamu, I'm showing no further enemies on scope. It looks like we saved our friends. Yeah. Red cockpit, by the way. You really pulled through for us. Thank you. Stick around till we're done here, then follow us. We'll talk about Marshal Davian's special assignment for you once we reach our encampment. All right. Good advice, though. Lose the dropship. Keep it suborbital if you need to relocate. The Big Mac will shoot you out of the sky if they think you're assisting us. Is one O like too many and lose the dropship? You're drop stuck ship. in the trenches with us till this is all over. On our burn towards the system, we caught the news saying that you blokes took out the local HPG station. That's a lie. I don't believe that for a second. No matter what the Confederation state-run news says. The HVG was our only hope of contacting anyone off-world about our dire situation here. It makes no sense that we would destroy the only means of saving ourselves. I think they ended the mission a little With bit too early here. shooting down our dropships and the HPG destroyed, we have no way of contacting anyone off-planet. Whoever destroyed the HPG most likely condemned us all to death. Okay. So... Couple, couple of recommendations for improving that mission. Have that story on what happened to the Fusiliers that, that, that she tells after this, uh, when the second assault is happening. Have her tell that story in between assaults. Have her tell that story in between assaults. That gives you time to loot the containers, and as you're looting the containers, she's telling the story. And then the fight happens. And then also, this part of it, um, in the end of the mission, don't black out of the mission yet while she's still talking. All right? Other than that, fun. Two million sea bills. We get a Warhammer for our troubles. Okay. What else do we get? I'm always on the hunt for double heat sinks, no double heat sinks. But in that case, I will take two PPCs. I'm gonna take two peeps and uh, uh, a jump jet. 4.4 million in salvage. Total damage, 235k. 1200 damage dealt in our beautiful little mech here. The Warhammer did 285, and that's with me shooting like a crazed madman. So, yeah. <laughs> the people saying that like the AI is still at the same status that, they, uh, that it was beforehand, but I think like maybe with the DLC now done, hopefully they'll they'll try to tackle this issue a little bit. Um, there are mods out there that, that increase like the, the two-hit chance of the AI, and that could help as well. And by the way, guys... Um, Data mining has confirmed that um, for enemy AI, not landsmate AI, enemy AI, the, be the higher the rank, the better they aim, and boss or elites basically always hit you. It doesn't matter how you twist, how you jump, it doesn't matter. They always hit you. It's a, it's a, it's a natural 20 every time. Uh, the closer you get. The closer you get, the more you get hit. So, which confirms my observation that you take more damage in a closer range. Contrary to what the devs told me. <laughs> All right. Captain Alamadamo is saying, Thanks for watching our backs out there, Commander. Ever since McCarran's killed a majority of the Fusilier on the Grey River, we are in bad shape. Lots of survivors that we found have several injuries or infections after weeks of surviving off Sana's jungle. Now, we've recovered a handful of mech warriors who are still fit for service after having their mechs blasted out from under them by the armored cavalry. If you don't mind taking on extra personnel, I'll assign them over to you as you see fit. 
They're good mech warriors, but I just don't have enough equipment to keep them in the fight. When you're ready, let's see what the Marshal Devian feel the need to send all of you. Let's see what made Marshal Devians feel the need to send all of you out this way to this hellhole on your lonesome. We get an AMS and we get Lieutenant Miasto Stepjorn. Who's not even all maxed. Like I would have liked to see like, like a 60 pilot. I would have liked to see like a, a pilot that has like 30 skills and goes up to 60 here. This guy isn't bad. In fact, he's actually better than my current guys, but doesn't have much future, right? All right. Oh, that's the next mission. Never mind. Uh, let me just go here. Start some repair orders. 22 days to repair. Jeebus. 8 days, 14 days, 6 days. Um, for some reason, we can purchase equipment here, like this tier 4 AC-20. Large chem lasers. Hell yeah. That's a good large lasers here. Tier 5 PPC. Yeah, tier 4 PPC. Not bad. And the difference in quality is insane. Like tier 1, 10 damage. Tier 4, 25% damage extra. So 5% per level. Plus, um, less heat. Higher max range, higher speed. Higher rate of fire. Like, everything's better. Basically. Yeah, but it's more laser. Anything else that's good here? Ultra AC5, half ammo. Okay. Am I using mods? Exclamation mark mods. Right now we're using three. They're updated on the list. List is in our Discord. See, we could buy mechs here. We could buy an awesome, we could buy a battle master, we could buy a cyclops. We could buy a stalker. Like, as far as shopping is concerned, you have no problems, right? As long as, you, if you don't play, like, salvage only like me, you can go shopping here. No pilots fire, though. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead, uh, save our progress. And then, see what is up in the next mission, in the next video.